Hi. In this video, we're going to look at the use of the quartile function. The quartile function allows us to analyze a range of numbers and split it into the four quarters, giving us four different values. This will allow us to identify the target audience for our product. So I'm going to show you how we do that. Um, and then I'm going to talk you through a little bit of uh, how we come up with our target audience from the data that's been analyzed. So again, we're going to use our age column. Uh, so the age column is on our cleanse data, which is this one here. Um, and what we're going to do, we're going to use the quartile function. So equals quartile. And then open a bracket. It's asking us what array we want to use. That's the name of the range of cells for our age. So I'm going to type in age. And then it's asking us for what quartile do we want. Now we could type in quartile number one. Okay, that's the 25th. Um, but we've already got our quartiles listed on the left hand side of that table. So I'm talking here in cell E4. So rather than typing in one, I can use this value. I can close my bracket and press enter. Now, when I drag a formula down, that E4, if I drag down with, this, uh, with the green box at the bottom of the cell, becomes um, E5, uh, sorry, F, uh, e, sorry, E5. And then if I drag down to the next one, it becomes E6 and so on. So if I drag this function down, or this formula down, like that, what you should be able to see, this one is looking at E4. So if you remember what the function does, okay, that's the quartile, okay. So we've got that. Um, and on my next one, I'm looking at E5, which is number two, and then E6, which is number three, and E7, which is number four. Just to confirm, I could have just used the numbers in there, like that, one, we'll put number two in here, and you can see it gives me the same answer. But it means I have to go through and physically change each of these different values. Okay, i change that to a four. You can see it gives me exactly the same answer. But what I've done is I've used, in place of the one, I've used the cell reference there and copied it down using that tool, which makes things quicker for us. So what this is saying is in the bottom 25% um, of people who have responded to the survey are age 12. Then the um, 50th percentile is 14. The 75th percentile is 16 and the 100th percentile is 18. So the suggestion is that when you choose your target audience, you look at the middle 50%. So that would be um, these two, okay? So that means that our target audience for our product that we produce will be between 14 and 16 years old. So that's how you use the quartile function and quartile analysis to determine the target audience of any product that you create.